Back, our students and teachers are wearing masks longer than they ever have before. And as classes get going, masks continue to draw controversy. Tonight, Michael Lockler showing us an experiment that demonstrates the difference that just a few seconds of not wearing a mask can make. We asked Intermountain Healthcare to help us with an experiment. By now, we've all heard we should wear masks, but we wanted to see what they really do. <coughs> Chelsea Hancock <coughs> is not sick. This is for science. 15 seconds of coughing without a mask, then with one. I'm using a cloth mask because that's what most people are using. What comes out of Chelsea's mouth are respiratory droplets. That's how the coronavirus spreads. And we're looking at just how easily the droplets can fly and if a mask matters. The way the bacteria works, it works very similar to the virus. And so we'd expect that this is pretty similar to how the virus might spread. Yes, correct. If you can keep your head when all about you are... Chelsea's also reciting a minute of poetry to show us how talking can spread the virus. To serve your Time. turn. The Petri dishes are off to an incubator here at Intermountain Central Lab. And a couple of days later, here's the result. On the mask side, clean plates. I was actually a little bit surprised that there was no growth on the side with the mask. Look at the most bacteria coughing without a mask. 15 seconds showed a ton of bacteria. Even if you had two or three coughs and you got your throat cleared, then there would still be a lot of bacteria and virus. Still quite a bit for coughing at the two foot mark and just a little beyond that. At six feet, social distancing, just one dot. Right there. Look at the buildup on this one. One minute of talking right in front of Chelsea's face, no mask. A lot of interactions, even at the drive through, if you're talking to that person face to face, it's about a minute, you know, and they're still spread. And here's talking without a mask at two feet. If I'm projecting more, it's going to go further. You definitely see more growth the longer you're talking. Definitely. More risk for infection. More risk for infection, absolutely. See the difference, the prevention that comes with a piece of cloth. So I was really surprised that there was no growth. You know, I think this proves that these masks actually do work. They contain a lot of the respiratory droplets of everyday life, talking, laughing, coughing, sneezing. Um, these masks do contain a good portion of you know, what we do in our everyday lives. A quick experiment you can do yourself, try to blow out a candle with your mask on. It's a lot harder with a thicker mask. Michael Locklear, 2 News.